Hi everyone. So today is gonna be a little different. As you see, I have a water bottle and I will be doing something with this, but for now, just get this out of the way. Okay. Um, so yeah. And we're going to be discussing Finding Dory. Oh, by the way, before we start that, just wanted to say, I saw none of you actually reached my limit, which is 90. But I'm gonna do a Dakota video, maybe over the weekend anyway, so that is fine. Uh, try to get those, like watch my videos a few more times. Even if you haven't seen them before or yet, that is fine. Yeah, and okay. So, before we do the thing with the water bottle, we're gonna be discussing Finding Dory. So, my thoughts. I'm gonna give Finding Dory 9.6. And you guys know how good that is for me. I think six is good. So anyway, Finding Dory is pretty much the Nemo story, but with Dory. So Dory remembers something about her parents because she gets like these memory sprouses. You like, she like remembers things throughout the movie. And then she, that leads her to her parents. Which, well, let me just tell you. So she goes on a whole adventure. She meets some friends. She meets this, um, she meets this octopus. And she meets other, like, friends. When, because it's pretty much the Nemo story. So the people, they scoop them up. They scoop Dory up. And then, and then they bring Dory to this place where she meets all like the creatures. It's kind of like at SeaWorld. And like there's tons of people. And so the fish, they're kind of like um, Nemo and Marlin, who is his father. They're kind of like out of the water and they're kind of like jumping from like water bucket. Okay, now into the pond now. And they're kind of like jumping over trying to find Dory, who's going crazy in this spot. At the end of the movie, she finds out her parents are dead but then she fo but then she follows a trail of seashells and then she finds out that her parents are still alive and there's a big happy end of the movie at the end of the movie so anyway you guys are wondering why do i have this water bottle so whoops <laughs> so one of my friends at school told me because I do this thing called the water bottle rise because what the water bottle flip got banned. And I'm hoping this video is gonna go viral. So this is the water bottle rise. You take one finger. And people are, and I'm hoping the goal of this is to get, it's super easy. So you just get addicted to the motion of going like this. And then it's really fun. So hold on. So yeah, hope you like that. <laughs> so anyway, I hope you guys like that. And okay, I guess nothing else really to talk about. And see you guys later.